All right, guys, welcome back to some more PGA Tour career mode, and this will be the last part before we get the full build of the game. So this is, as I said, a little bit of an early build, but it's close to what the full game is going to be, and I'm playing on PC. But I'll be starting my career mode on PS4, closer to release, and I'll get up to the same point that we are in this career mode, and I'll continue on with part four, obviously. But I just want to thank you all for the humongous support. I don't actually know what the support is like, but I already know you guys are going to kill it. My golf... My my golf boys got me. That's a fact. Golf boys 2.0. Let's go. All right, we're going to jump in to the Sand Dune Classic at TPC Scottsdale, the second event of the Corn Ferry Tour. We're in tied 34th at the moment in the point standings after our finish in the last event. Um, but if we get into the top 25, we'll automatically qualify for the PGA Tour. And if we get into the top 75, we'll go into a playoff for the PGA Tour. So let's, uh, let's do this thing, man. I'm excited to get back into it. And I'm um, excited to play some more. So uh, I want to give a shout out to 2K as well. And the go the boys at the golf club for all the support they've shown me. And the, the, the opportunities they've gave me, I suppose, over the last few years. Including the golf club and, uh, and with PGA as well. I got to interview... Um, sorry, I'm just trying to listen to the commentators at the same time. Hi Luke, great to be here. Looking forward to bringing you guys the action from my perspective. Damn straight, John. But yeah, I got to interview uh, Sean West and uh, another developer before the Golf Club 2019 came out, which was absolutely incredible to do. And um, then I got to attend this preview event for PGA Tour 2K21 and get all this early content out for you guys. So it's, it's a privilege, it's an honor, and uh, let's keep it going here with part number four. Uh, if you want to enter the giveaway, you already know what to do. I told you guys in the first two parts, all you have to do to enter the giveaway is follow me on Instagram and DM me telling me that you want to be entered or else use the Gleam link down below. That's a separate giveaway. There's two different giveaways. So there you go. That was a, a fast drive to start like off. And it should fairway. hopefully stick on the fairway. Stay, 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 stay. Yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Right, I'm gonna try a couple practice swings here and um, just to get into the rhythm of things because I haven't played in a little bit there That was still fast. I can't believe that. Wow That was perfect perfect. Okay, there we go No, that was fast again. Okay, let's try try it with the vibration again That was slow Boom. Still fast I, I just can't get the rhythm of it right, huh? There we go. That was it. That was the one. That was slow, yeah. I knew that one. I'd barely even push that forward. There you go. Alright, I'm getting a couple of a couple more of them perfect now at least. So hopefully that will continue as we go. I might hit a normal shot here though. And just hit a a sandwich. With a little bit of D loft maybe or something. Get a little bit of D loft, get that to kick forward a small bit. I knew I was going to hit that fast, too. That might be okay, though, because... Right yeah, that is okay. That's in the hole. Oh! <laughs> I was going to say, that's going to be okay that it's fast, because that one was a little bit... Um, going to be a little bit short, otherwise. I can't see myself not making birdie, either. Ha <laughs> ha! What a shot. And a birdie to start off at TPC Scottsdale. Sets the tone for the rest of the day. That's, that's facts. Yeah. Alexander Ryan is 5 under through 17, so he's set in the early pace. Watch the round progress. Let's see what happens here on the second hole. Let's see what shuts your mouth on the second hole, huh? The wind actually isn't strong at all, so I'm going to aim in the middle of the fairway. That bunker ain't even going to come into play, man. This is a par 4, longish one. There's nothing really? Was that fast? Down after that wicked hook. Good lord, that's going to kick right, big time. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. No. You know All right. Not great. Don't you know. Be over -ambitious. I am going to yes, be overambitious, though. A big bowl of spinach salad. It's just gnarly in there. All right. You guys need to relax with that. You're kind of creeping me out. All right. We're going to hit this club. It's going to hit a small bit of a draw. And I am going to put some D loft on this as well. Here we go. Going Ooh, slow? Really? Ooh, okay. 
Not far away from being decent. I think if that was perfect, perfect, it might have been decent. Now, coming out of the rough, missing the green was always in the cards. Put some loft on this bad boy and get it to just... Let's get this to one hop and stop right in the hole, hopefully. Ah, yeah, that'll work. That'll work! That'll work! It's a par on the second. Birdie par start, that's a good up and down there to uh, settle down the round after starting with a birdie, because if I had a PBFU there, I would have lost my mind. Uh, by the way, guys, if you want to buy some merch like this, this is my own merch. You can't actually buy this specific one anymore, but um, if you want to buy some merch, there's a link in the description, which will take you to the Teespring store. I got some cool designs, and maybe we'll bring out a new design before uh, for PGA 2K21 launch. That could be a good idea, you know, bring out a new, uh, a new design, maybe specifically for golf, could be cool. God damn it! I think I know, need to go do that swing calibration again. Because I can't do shit anymore. I'm just hitting everything fast again. No, come on. What is that bounce? Good lord. Just didn't want to stop at all. We weren't going to be able to get there anyway, so it's not a big deal. Pretty nicely in the sand. Shouldn't have too much trouble getting out. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. That was alright. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. And it's perfect. Now we'll get up That's and down the for the birdie. Pretty These are the shots that I struggle with the most, though, I swear. These kind of pitch shots, man. I don't know why it is, but I just struggle with them. I'm going to try to put a good bit of loft on this and get it to just land nice and soft there. Oh, That, is a that was beautiful, beauty. actually. It was fast a little bit, but still okay, I think. Spin. There you go. See? Got that little bit of check with the pitch oh, shot now, which is wild. nice. And that should give well, us be a good birdie. Let's make this birdie putt. I think I just have to accept the fact that I'm going to hit it a little bit fast right. every time. <laughs> and kind of play that into my, um... Play that into my game, you know? Alright, two under through three. And we're only three shots back of the leader, but this Brody guy is five under through seven. Good well, lord. Okay, buddy. Let's see what happens here. Hole four challenge, score par are better with one putt. Okay, I see. Basically, just uh, have to get a one putt par or one putt birdie, not a one putt bogey. All right, I'm gonna hit the 180 here because it's risky as hell to. I'm gonna try hit a little bit of a fade maybe to get this to land a tad soft if I can, and then I'll put some loft on it as well, and we'll hope for the best here. Going with the fire Fast. So I might need to sit. That would have been good too, I think. I just can't. I don't understand, man. I can't seem to get the rhythm of it. I thought I was getting it yesterday. I need to go to the range well, maybe for like a good 20 floor? minutes and just Could get it into worse? my head to There's to not hit it like I was in golf club and just what? literally just it drill it into my head to hit There's it perfect, perfect every single time. Or maybe just hit like 12 practice strokes in a row, or 20 practice strokes in a row here in a second. After this hole, after I hold this putt, get in. That's the right get in, finish. get in! Oh! It was a gallant attempt. It was a gallant attempt. I'll, I'll well give us done. that much. It would have been a really nice birdie. Let's we'll take, take the par the there. As it stands. And your man fist pumps. Waves to the crowd. And we're all good, baby. Let's go. Trailing by four strokes. Trailing by four strokes. Okay. Brody's six under through eight. That's a little bit this ridiculous. Alright, I just hit seven out of ten practice swings perfect perfect one was slow and the other two were one was very fast and one was fast so come on i'm getting the rhythm now there you go perfect perfect well it was 101 percent power that ain't gonna make a difference if i hit it 101 percent power every time i'll be happy there you go i just need to kind of really get into the rhythm of it hit a good few shots in a row where i'm hitting that perfect perfect momentum Okay, we'll put a bit of loft on this bad boy. Life is good, man. Life is good. No, I knew yeah, I hit that one fast. On See, if I hit it fast and I know I hit it fast, I don't mind. But I just need to know what the rhythm is. There you go. It's not too bad. It's a birdie chance. You like that, didn't you? We're playing well so far. Like, uh, even though I'm hitting a lot of these shots fast, we're still... Two under through four holes, and we have a birdie School putt here on the fifth. With threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. Yes, good putt to make. You know this. 
All right, it breaks right, right at the start, then it breaks left again, then it breaks back to the right at the very end, I feel like, but... Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna try this. Get in. Get in, you beauty. No. Yikes, way too much pace on that. This one just hmm. inside seven feet to the hole. Ouch, that hurts. What? Putting for bogey. It didn't show that break when I was down the other fucking side, did it? Or did I just literally lose my mind? I'm an idiot. I guess. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Two great shots are required here because this hole is a long putt. Literally a three putt bogey out of nowhere, man. We played that hole pretty well also. Like, come on. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That was stupid. That was just an absolute lapse in concentration right there. That was fast. Yeah. God damn it, dude. What am I doing? I knew it as well the second I hit that one. Like, I just need to relax a little bit or something. I'm flicking it forward. I'm just so used to that momentum of flicking it forward. I gotta say, I love your positive vibe. It's annoying as hell. Unfortunately, that one has ended up in the bunker. Shut up. Alright? Just shut up. Shut up. Just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Just shut up. Shut up. I'm gonna put some D-loft on this. Oh no, that's not even getting there. It's gonna be short. Only hit at 92% power, unfortunately. It's gonna be a chip and a putt, hopefully. A little chip and a putt to get up and down. Get up and down from here. Alright, I'm just gonna chip it like it is, I think. Maybe a little bit of D-loft. Not what I wanted. It was a good swing, it was just not full power. If that was full power, it would have been pretty good, I think. Needs this to save power. Oh, Jesus Christ, man. If I make back-to-back -back bogeys, I swear. No, that's not even close. Ooh. That is a two pathetic bogeys in a row, man. I didn't even play the holes that bad. Like, this hole I played pretty poorly. But the one, the one before, I didn't even play that bad. Just terrible short game there on the last two holes. Really terrible stuff. Now playing a little Alright, let's get back under par, get back yeah, into the top ten, have a, have a good top ten finish. That would be really yeah. nice at Scottsdale. Off here at the There's some scorable holes, 100% on this course, like, definitely. Okay, I have to hit this, but I gotta hit some big loft on it, and maybe get it to land softly in the middle of the green, if possible. God, fast. Just needs this one to kick right. That's gonna kick left. That kicked pretty straight. It's not too bad. But again, just the fast. It's not what you want. What they were looking for. You think? And missing it long with that approach, not a good leave. Thanks, bud. Appreciate it. Get in. Get in! Oh, come on! How many times can I burn the edges like that? Gotta say. Jeez, I still haven't chipped in. Come on, bro. I'm chip. My chipping's actually got a lot better. For the most part, uh, I had a poor chip on six there, but like for the most part, my chipping's got much better. But I've burned the edges so many times now with them. I just want to chip one in. Brody's seven under through eleven. Like this is ridiculous. Just a couple of play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eighth. The green and regulation on hole eight. I can't believe this is on the normal difficulty. By the way, I can't even imagine being able to compete with the guys on the the harder difficulties. I guess that's if you're playing on the easiest settings, right? It's more kind of for those people. There you go. Another great shot there. So I'm hitting the tee shots okay now. It's just kind of the iron shots and and the hybrid shots and stuff like that that I need to I need to work on getting the momentum of the tempo of I should say rather a little bit better. Well, that's a handy shot. Time for the second shot at the eighth. Right, I'm gonna try and get this to maybe come off the. Well, I can aim straight at it, actually, because you know how, you know how I hit a fast all the fucking time. Right, I'm going to put a bit of lock. This is actually a six iron, so I'm going to want to land it a little bit short to the flag stick. This is the carry distance, after all. Uh, I'm going to try a little bit of a fade to go against the grain of the way we're hitting it here. Okay. We are on quite a, a down slope here to the, to the left. Fast. Yep. 
That might kick though. That might kick. It's heading left, isn't it? No, I thought it was gonna kick back. That's gonna be incredibly difficult now. Didn't hit the mark. Yeah, it took a bit too I'm gonna have to put max on loft line. on this and hopefully get it to stop up relatively quickly on the green. Oh, what a what a chip! Come on, come on! Give me my chip in, man! Give me my chip in! I need it. All right, we're not playing as well now, but we got up and down a couple times here and uh, saved par. So settled the round down after the back-to-back -back bogeys. Okay, seven hundred to twelve, Brody. We're at level par still. We're obviously not catching him, but as long as I'm in like the top ten in these events and kind of get in the top twenty-five, qualify for the PJ Tour. Then we can kind of make the events uh, more two, three rounds, maybe something like that, and then we'll. It should be easier to compete in the events. What we need to get better as well, obviously, because I'm not good enough at the moment. Oh, that was actually perfect, perfect. Even though I sliced it a little bit, I tried to look at the golfer there and look at his swing rather than look at the thing down the bottom of the screen. I might honestly turn it off because I don't know is that maybe a little bit distracting but then for the chipping and the putting you kind of you kind of need it right a little bit you've kind of needed for this stuff um seven iron should be good actually just a little bit of loft get to land right right there if possible near near the near enough to the flag stick anyway there again I looked at the golfer 97 percent power that's going to be real good. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Oh my god! Literally, I am on fire right now with my chips and irons and I'm like burning the edges. There you go. Back under par. What a shot. Definitely, I think that's the way to go. It's kind of hard to focus on the golfer over the percentage thing down the bottom, but I think that's the way to go for us. I'm doing a lot better doing that now with those last two shots. I hit them both perfect, perfect uh, tempo. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Let's see. Yeah, see, looked at the golfer again. Perfect, perfect, like down the middle. Because that that's, that's what I'm used to doing in the golf club as well. I wonder if that's more of a thing as well, where I, when I'm focusing on the timer down the bottom, I'm messing it up a little bit. But when I'm focusing on the golfer, I'm kind of doing more what I was doing with the golf club. Oh, we're screwed here. We don't have a club for this at all. I got to go with the 9 iron and put some big loft on it and get it to... Sit down nicely, maybe at the front of the screen, if possible. Uh, not the front of the screen, rather. The front of this pin is what I meant to say. Okay, see, the percentage shots are kind of where you need to look at it, though. If I'm hitting a full shot, it's a lot easier to... Um, to look at the golfer. But maybe I can still do it with the haptic feedback. Opting for the it was 79% power. It wasn't far away from being decent, and I didn't look at the percentage thing at all there. And that works out pretty okay, I would say. Um, a nice approach I'm kind of using, pin yeah, I was using the vibration the a little bit there. The there you go. This for another. I thought he was saying at the last. Trying I was going to say this is a tenth hole, mate. Right, when are we getting to that par three? Not too far away. See, the putting is where you need it's to look up. at it. it could be in. Oh my god, oh, dude. Literally, I'm ball. an inch away on no every single type off. of shot. Irons, putting, and down it goes. chips, it doesn't matter. I can't get the ball in the hole. It's literally like... Maintain their position on the leaderboard. It's like my ball has a magnet to go away from the hole or something. It's crazy. Alright, we're in the top 20 though. Welcome to this hole. That's a par four. Top 20. Uh, drive the ball 295 yards. Okay. We can do that. Right? Should I try hit this one fast? There you go. No, this one looks to be Should get it go a little bit further? That's well over 295. That's over 300, baby. 305, son. That's the way we like it. All right, 180. Imagine not being only able to hit your 5-iron 180 when you look like this. Come on, bro. <laughs> I can hit my 5-iron like 200 at least. That's a little bit whack, honestly, brother. Alright. Try to get it to land like on this little slope here, but not... Uh, no, actually, I don't want it to land on that, really, do I? I'd rather hit a fade and kind of get it around there. Yeah. 
Just a little bit fast. That honestly wasn't very bad. That was pretty good. But sits there. Sit, sit there. Sit there. Yeah, if that was perfect, perfect, it would have been real good. Real good. But we'll take that. It's still pretty good. We got a birdie. We got a birdie putt here. Slightly downhill. No, it's more like even, to be honest. And it, it does break quite a bit here, significantly. Yeah, I knew I didn't give that enough. I knew I didn't give that enough straight away. But some of the other putts I've been giving too much, so I was kind of a little bit nervous of that. But we'll take the par. Not too bad. Okay, one under par. We got seven holes remaining. Let's make sure to finish strong. Definitely not finish like we did in the last, uh, <laughs> in the first career mode video. <laughs> <laughs> Time to make a move. I told you guys not to bring that up. Alright, 188. I actually think this will be perfect. Legitimately. Maybe just a little tad of D-loft. Just a tad little bit. Get it to, to roll on there a little bit nicely. Okay, that was only a tiny bit fast. That actually should kick to the right a little bit. It should. It should come to the right a little bit. A little bit. Come on. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming, baby. It's actually going a little bit further than I anticipated. I guess that was because of the fast nature of the shot. It's going to be a tough downhill putt, 100%. It's not going to be an easy putt. Eh, it's not maybe as bad as I thought. Maybe not as bad as I thought. Go on, turn. Turn for me, baby. Oh, it didn't turn as much as I thought at all there. See, that's what I mean where I'm like overdoing some of them. The last one we underdone quite a bit. But that one we overdone quite a bit. And that puddle drop. Well done. Hmm. Another par. Three pars to start off the back nine, but we've got a par that five coming up here. Which par five is this? Bruce this is the one with the water? Once said, I'm going down, down, Are we still down. in the top 20? Not good. Going down, down, down. <laughs> Shut up. Par five on this one. Is this the infamous par last, five? No. Okay. It does have water, but you know the one I'm talking about. That's the next one. TPC Scottsdale is a great course, I must say. All right, a little bit fast, but that's okay. Oh, good drive. That one should find the fairway. Boom, boom, boom. We'll take that. 300 up the middle, son. Left side, maybe a little bit. We won't, we won't, uh, we won't be picky. See, this is where like we need the higher clubs, man, because we le we legit could easily go for this if we get a sponsorship with clubs that go a little bit further, man. Because, like, that's pathetic. Your three wood goes 227. Come on, man. You're a professional golfer. Well, we're not yet, I suppose. We're an amateur golfer at the moment, but come on. Get your shit together, young man. I'm going to try to hit a little bit of a fade with the driver. I don't even care. Uh, it's a brave one. That was really bad. That was really bad. Well, this should be unpredictable. Thank God it got through there, at least. It's not too bad now. And actually, we and should be able to get up and down for here, from here. Should be able to get up and down. Goes that way a little bit. Hmm. Not what you want. That's going to be short, short, short. I probably needed to be further up anyway. Like I did, pretty much. Alright, let's see. It breaks to the right pretty much the entire way. It doesn't break back to the left till after the hole, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Eight foot up though. I need to hit this like a forty yard putt then, huh? Forty foot putt rather. Okay. Let's see right there. Get in. Get in. Get in. It's still not reaching. It's still not reaching. Oh my god! I thought that was gonna be in. How does that still not reach? It was eight inches up, and I hit a the thirty two foot putt like it was a forty footer. It should reach, right? That's a poor par on a par five there, and we're just playing we're playing kind of tame golf at the moment, I would say. A little par four. The fairway's narrow here, so we have to be good on, off the tee. Have to be decent off the tee at least. A little bit fast, but should be just fine. Should be just fine. If I hit every tee shot a little bit fast with the driver, I wouldn't mind it. But it's the other shots that I need to kind of get a better, be better rhythm with. Okay, uh, this actually should be just perfect. This 5 iron here, just a little bit of loft. Get it to like right here. And just try and get it to land soft on the front of the green. It should be perfect. Let's try 
Practice swing and hit a couple good perfect shots. There you go. No, nope, that was fast. Mm, I thought that was gonna be perfect. That was slow. Okay, overdone at that time a little bit. That was fast again. God damn it. You can kind of see with his swing that he's kind of pushing it forward fast. I can't not hit it fast on this one. I was I, why can't why can't I get a perfect perfect? There we go. There we go. It wasn't far enough, but it was perfect perfect at least. Still fast. Good lord, I can't believe it. There we go. Haptic feedback, baby. Way fast. Good lord. But there you go. Perfect, perfect. Okay, that's the way we're gonna hit it. Let's just hit it like that. There you go. Beautiful. Beautiful golf shot. That's what we wanted exactly. Lance soft, Lance soft. Oh, it's an absolute beauty. Oh, what a shot. Oh, what a shot. We took our time with that one. The rules official was over for time wasting. And they, they put me on the clock, but it was worth it. It was worth it, my friends. What a shot. That's all we need to be doing. Just hitting a couple more practice shots here and there, I guess. What? How does that not break at the end? Job done. Oh That's my good. god, like what is up with this game? Now, my putting five. sucks. I can't hold anything at all. Let's I legit just cannot hold anything. It's crazy. This is my favorite par 5 on the course, but we're not going to be able to reach it with, this, with these dumb clubs. This dumb club set. There like you go. Great drive. Great drive. Looks like it came out of a goddamn cannon, Luke. Unfortunately, we're probably gonna have to lay up. I would say I still think we're gonna have a good 250 to the pin And I don't think it's worth hitting driver off the deck here. Oh, no, we might be able to reach actually. Yeah, we, we can 100% Okay, never mind. I even want to put some loft on this maybe Got to land softly at that front part of the fairway and just mm, Damn it that's uh, heading into the rough. I think. Yikes man that could have been so good if I hit that perfect perfect like it legit could have been Right on it. I had the perfect club for that. That's a little unfortunate, honestly. Okay, we have an 80% lie. It's gonna land like right there. Perfect. Not exactly what I was intending, but we'll take it. Yeah, that was silky smooth. That the bunkers are all about those that feel, baby. It's just about three feet away. I nearly missed that. Like I'm not even trolling, I nearly missed that. Alright, we're two under. Three to play. I like Scott Stale as a course. It's definitely scorable. And if I was playing, if, if I was putting a little better and holding out a little board. better today, like we could have a really good score. Lovely momentum for this player. But After that the we're last still hole. just getting into the flow of things, man. I'm going to be doing a lot of practice before uh, before my part four. <laughs> That's for sure. A lot of practice. Okay, we got the... Wait, this ain't the stadium hole. The hell? Where's the stadium to the left? Oh, I guess they don't have it for the, for the Corn Ferry Tour, huh? That's funny. Makes sense, though. Alright. Let's see. Come on. If I hit this good, right, it's gonna be decent. Maybe just a tiny bit of the loft. Looks to have chosen the 7 iron. <sighs> God, dude. Fucking fast again, man. I can't fathom it. Yeah, nicely played. Slim chance for a birdie. But in all reality, I can't two fathom it. Par would be just fine. You think? You want to move into the top ten on the leaderboard? Well, let's hold this putt. Let's hold this putt. Look at this. Remaining. Look at this. I actually got it pretty spot on. Damn, I got it really spot on, huh? I'm kind of a genius. It's not gonna reach. Big chance here. Yeah. That is really good, but oh, it's not gonna so reach. Close. I mean, I cheated, but. And this putt coming up for his par. I was pretty spot on either way. Drops, and we're on. Okay, two holes remaining. Let's uh, make sure to at least finish in the at this two under par. Par? Far? far? Two under far? Two under par score. We're in the top 15. I'd like to get into the top 10. Maybe yeah, one more birdie would get us into the top 10 if possible. It would be really They're nice. Trailing it, heading into the short par four. Do they take it on to the layup? How much do they trust their swing right now? I'm going Find for it. Out. I'm going for it. 
God damn it, the one time I'm trying to hit it fast, I hit it perfect, perfect. I was legitimately trying to hit it fast that time. Maybe I need to try hit it fast every time and then I'll, I'll end up hitting it perfect. That's funny as hell. <laughs> I'm gonna hit a flop here. I'm going to hit a nice little flop shot, eh? Get it to land soft at the front of this green. And sp or, sorry, at the front of this pin and, and just kill it. Just absolutely kill it. Fast. Should be okay though. And that's gonna be another birdie. This one's for birdie. We'll take that, son. Well, maybe it's gonna be another birdie. Let's go. Let's go! Birdie number five, three under par. And we have, we really had a solid back nine, no bogeys at all. We just kind of didn't really make anything either. But last hole, let's finish with a birdie. We're in the top ten. Let's go. We're in the top ten. I wonder where we're going to be in the overall standings after this tournament now. Beautiful. Got a little bit of a draw coming up the last hole. That's a good drive. That's a good drive. Perfect. 300 yards in the middle of the fairway. Nice Couldn't time. place it any better, son. Second shot here at the All right, 136. I'm going to put some loft on this. Okay, try land nice and soft on the right side of the hole there. And um, I'm just going to try a couple practice swings here. Just with the 9 iron and stuff like that, I want to see, can I not hit it fast? Right? Because I, I seem to, with the lower irons, just hit it fast. Oh, there we go. That was much smoother, though. Like, that was quite slow, actually. Like, that's still fast. Jesus. You really gotta go pretty slow. That was perfect, but it was too hard. That was good. Just a little bit uh, low on power, but it was good. That was good. Alright, that was really good. Yeah, looking at the golfer is 100% much better than looking at the goddamn... Meter. Game with the nine iron, I think. God, I hit that one way fast. Just needs a little bit more of a kick to the right. That was pathetically bad to finish. I would have liked to finish with one of those practice swings well, that, that I hit. Th that those were much better. <laughs> made birdie on the last, looking for a second in a row here. Imagine. And this putt for a final score of 67. Mmm, just needed a little more power, actually. Oh, that's a fantastic just a little more power. Didn't drop. But Scottsdale was a good round, a good decent round of two un uh, three under, and we're heading in the right direction, guys. Once I, once I get my short game in order, and once I get that, that fast swing completely cut out, we'll really be able to start making a, a, a run at these guys at the top of the leaderboard, like Brody Patton there and stuff like that, because even playing poorly at times, I'm 100%... Uh, not doing too badly. Like, just three under, playing kind of so-so, having a couple of stupid mistakes. It's definitely, uh, we can build upon that 100%. And we've went up 15 positions there in the points rank, which is, is nice as hell. That's good as hell, man. We like to see that, son. Brody Patton went up as well. Obviously, he won the tournament. So if you win the tournament, you get 500 points. Like, that'll take, that'll skyrocket you. As you can see, we are in the positions now to qualify for the PGA Tour automatically, though. We're on 98 points uh, in 19th position. But if we got, like, a, a win, it would take us to third automatically. So, like, yeah, a win would be absolutely huge. But I don't see us getting a win the way we're playing at the moment with how difficult the AI is. They're shooting, like, eight seven under per round maybe at the summit championship we'll make that one two rounds that could be an interesting finish to the to the corn ferry classic we make the last tournament two rounds or something like that but this is going to be the end of the career mode for now until uh the full game comes along uh don't forget to check out the giveaway giveaway don't forget to check me out on twitter instagram and uh i shall see you guys in the very near future it's been my distinct pleasure to bring you this early coverage and i'll still have a couple more uh, random rounds here or there going up on the channel as well. I'm going to try to calibrate my swing again maybe and uh, hopefully get the perfect, perfect feel with the swing a lot better before we move over onto PS4. It's been my pleasure to serve you all. I'll see you next time. Peace out.